Hey, yeah, it's Monday today. Um, yeah, special week for me. And, uh, yeah, yeah, it's been good. But good weekend. I hope everyone else has had a good weekend. Um, yeah, I, I was a bit disappointed I didn't do that big run in Ely yesterday. But um, the weather was pretty bad. And um, I did a, you know, I did my talk at the AA meeting um, last night. And I was talking to... The lady who sort of like runs the meeting, and she said there wasn't that many takers. And I think you know because it was yesterday morning and the weather was pretty, looked pretty grim. And it, it looked as if it was going to be in for the day. So you know, running sixty-eight um, kilometers in Drizzly September day, you know, weren't doesn't I don't think that sort of like <laughs> floated a lot of people's boats really. Um, but yeah, so yeah, I'm really in front of myself today. I've um, I've run, I've done my insanity. I've started a new um, yoga course this week. Um, and it's on Beach Beach Body on Demand, and I see they've been they've been um, they've been advertising on the TV. And Beach Body on Demand is I think is a pretty clean cut company. I do a lot of my a lot of my workouts come from them. Uh, insanity um, p90x and um, you can do this thing now I think I think if I understood what they said on the TV correctly I think you can have a free month and you, you can have um, um, beach body on demand but so you've got the you got the got it on your on your um, on your device and you can access all their all their different workouts and things which is really good because if you bought I think remember if I when I bought Insanity, I think it was about hundred quid. So I think that's it's something like forty dollars a month, so it's about thirty quid a month, something like that. So you know, it's cheaper than having a personal trainer. I shouldn't really be saying that being a personal trainer. Um yeah, so it's something to look out for. Um yeah, so I've got this yoga thing off that. And um yeah, yeah, last night was good. Um three friends uh, from Cambridge AA um, took me took me to Ely, so that was, that was nice. That was like we were like the last gang in town, you know. It was kind of good, you know. And um, yeah, I did my spiel. I never know what I'm going to say on those sort of things. I really don't. I just get in there and I'm a bit like this, really. I just take my gob and see what comes out. And um, yeah, it seemed to go down all right. And um, yeah, I mean, it, it it sort of spun me back a bit, really, because. Um, the woman who, who was running the meeting, I didn't. I'd met her once before. I thought, and then when when she started talking, she said, "Yeah, well, I remember you, and I remember seeing you running all over Cambridge." And I, I, I had no idea, you know. And um, I, it sort of spun me back to when I, you know, when I first went into IA, um, oh, a long time. thing that put me off it in the first instance was, you know, going along and, you know, bear in mind that it's Alcoholics Anonymous and everyone knew I was. But if you think about it, I mean, I was a landlord at the time, it's hardly surprising that a group, <laughs> a group of drunks, you know, sort of knew who I was because, you know, I was quite, quite well known as a local landlord and uh, even though I say it myself. And yeah, but yeah, it was it was a nice evening there. Really nice bunch of people. Um, very very friendly, very welcoming. And uh, it is a nice little town. Um, my my well, city it is, isn't it? My mum, uh, my mum's sister used to live there, and my my cousin and his wife lived there. And uh, yeah, I've, I've always had kind of a soft spot for uh, for uh, for reading. It always reminds me of Christmas because I used to take my mum there to see her sister. Christmas time because it's my auntie's birthday in December, so we used to go over and take birthday presents and, you know, Christmas presents, cards, what have you, you know, and uh, yeah, so that's it. Yeah, always, I've kind of got festive memories of Ely. Um, yeah, so I enjoyed, I enjoyed that, and uh, like I say today, I'm, I'm well in front of myself. Uh, I've got a client this morning at eleven, and um, I'm doing some Reiki, which is good. And uh, week Wednesday, I start the 
I start the um, insanity classes on, on a Wednesday and a Friday. Now, I, it would be really, really useful if anyone is thinking of doing these, could, could contact me because then I can start sort of like making plans and decide which, you know, at the moment they're, they're going to give me quite a small room. But if there's going to be... If there's going to be a few of us doing it, we're going to need we're going to need more bit of bigger room. So I don't want I want to get this all sorted out before before we get started. I don't want to I don't want it to be a I don't want it to be a cock up. Um, you know, like these things often are when they start out. So yeah, so if if you could let me know, that'd be really good. And uh, if you're having it, it's the first the old thing. If you're you know if you're in half a mind to do it, just do it anyway. You know, um, first session of the three, um, let's see how it goes. Um, yeah, you know, it's, it's challenging, but it's good, it is good, and I'll make it fun, and we'll have a laugh. Um, yeah, and sorry, oh, that's what I've done this morning. Yeah, I went out for a really early run this morning, you know, right near where I live. Um, I sort of cut, cut across a bit of lawn, and uh. Um, yeah, I must have been giving off good vibes because it was just like happily eating away as I ran past and it didn't run up into a ball or anything like that, which is what they usually do. And um, yeah, it's nice to see that. I mean, although I'm living in an area which most people could, would consider to be like Cambridge's ghetto or hood, you know, it's, um, I quite like it here. I mean, I, I, I said before, I get woken up by the Zoom chorus and that. Uh, and, um, you know, I mean, quite often I, I, I don't have to run far to be, you know, spin myself out into the countryside. Only about sort of five, ten minutes and I'm, you know, I'm in greenery. And, um, yeah, I mean, you know, especially if I, if I go out early in the morning, I'll see foxes. Um, the other morning I saw a, um, a red kite, um, see buzzards, um, you know, mutineer deer, I often see mutineer deer. Um, I don't see a lot of badgers. I mean, sadly, the, the most of the badgers I see are around the egg room, which is you know, always what I find a bit heartbreaking because they're such beautiful creatures. But um, yeah, so you know, it's, I like, I like say, I like living here. It's all right, you know. Um, a lot of people are a bit sniffy about it, but you know, it works for me. And I think, you know, I think I'll leave it there because I've got quite a bit to get going. And, um, I'll get get back to you tomorrow. But like I say, if you could remember, you know, to inbox me um, if you if you are thinking of doing the insanity, because I really it would be really handy if I could, I could get a vague idea of numbers and I, you know, I'll plan. Oh, okay, thanks a lot. I'll speak to you tomorrow. Bye.